Kung nais mong matutupan, makinig ka lagi sa amin. Kung gusto mo ng kasayahan, ika'y amin. Ahandugan, may kwentuhan ng kaalaman, may kantahan at kasiyahan. May kwentuhan ng kaalaman, may kantahan at kasiyahan. Kung nais mo matutupan, makinig ka lagi sa amin. Kung gusto mo ng kasayahan, ika'y amin. Hahandugan, may kwentuhan ng kaalaman, may kantahan at kasiyahan, may kwentuhan. Nang kaalaman, may kantahan at kasiyahan. Ang Portis FB Live ay maaasahan mo tunay. Dagdag kaalaman, kantahan at kasiyahan. Luzon, Visayas, ang Mindanao, napapakinggan. Kapuso at kapamilya, saan dako ng mundo. Pintuhan ng kaalaman, may kantahan at kasiyahan. May pintuhan ng kaalaman, may kantahan at kasiyahan. May pintuhan ng kaalaman, may kantahan at kasiyahan. May pintuhan. Makinig ka lagi sa amin. Alright, isang uh, magandang gabi sa ating lahat. Luzon, Visayas at uh, Mindanao. Tayo po ngayon ay uh, live na naman ngayon. No? Live na live na naman po tayo ngayong gabi. Dito sa ating nasimulang uh, kwentuhan ng kalaman, kantahan, at may kasamang kasayahan. At uh, sa ngayong gabi po, ang atin pong Kuya Jess, ang atin pong Bok Nico, ay uh, hinihintay natin na pumasok sa ating uh, uh, studio para nang sa ganoon maumpisahan ang atin pong uh, pagtalakay nitong napakaganda na namang topic. Ha? Makinig ho kayo mga kapwa ko, magagawang palipunan, mga social workers and development uh, workers na naglilingkod sa iba't ibang uh, mga ahensya ng pamahalaan, pampublikong uh, tanggapan at maging sa mga pribadong uh, sektor o tanggapan ng ating uh, ipunan. At uh, bago ho tayo magpatuloy, atin muna hong pasalamatan ang lahat po ng mga social workers no, sa pagdiriwang ho nitong uh, ating uh, 
ikatatlong uh, uh, kaarawan o pagdiriwang ng atin pong uh, uh, Pilipino Social Workers Day na kakatapos lamang po no ho, noong nakaraang uh, linggo, June 19, 2022. Na ito po ay uh, dinaluhan ho ng iba't iba pong mga uh, social workers sa buong uh, Pilipinas. Siyempre dahil Pilipino. No? Pilipinong uh, manggagawang panlipunan. No? Yan po ay uh, isinabatas. No? Nilagdaan po ng ating uh, Pangulong Rodrigo Roa Duterte, ang atin pong outgoing uh, president. Mga ilang araw na lamang po. No? At uh, sa bahaging yan, marami hong mga uh, aktibidades na ginawa. Ito pong uh, ASEAN Social Work Consortium dito po sa ating bansa no sa pangunguna po ng iba't iba pong mga organization members ano po ito po ng ating uh, uh, social work consortium dito ho sa Pilipinas at uh, kabahagi ho dito ang uh, atin laging binabati no ho madalas ho nating batiin ang lahat ng ito dahil kabahagi ho sila nitong uh, ASEAN Social Work Consortium at akin na pong uh, uumpisahan No, para ho sa hindi ho nakakaalam, tayo po ngayon ay live na live ho dito ho sa General Santos. General Santos City dito ho sa rehiyon ng uh, Region 12, no ho, dito sa uh, Cotabato Region, no ho. Uh, live ho tayo dito sa General Santos. Magandang gabi sa mga taga General Santos City. Magandang gabi ho sa lahat ng mga social workers dito ho sa ating uh, uh, Region 12 ha. Live na live ho ang mga kasamahan ho natin dito ay akin pong binabati no ho. Ang lahat po ng mga social workers dito sa Region 12. At siyempre sa buong Pilipinas kasi ho tayo ay napapanood mula sa Luzon, Visayas at uh, dito ho sa Mindanao. Um Kabahagi ho ng pagdiriwang dito sa ating uh, ASEAN Social Work Consortium or Filipino Social Workers Day noong uh, 2018 ah, 20, 22 no noong uh, June 19. Atin pong pasalamatan una ang Department of Social Welfare and Development. No sa pamamagitan ho ng DSWD tayo po ay uh, uh, nagkaroon ho ng uh, successful uh, celebration at siyempre sa pangunguna ho ito ng uh, ASEAN Social Work uh, Consortium no ho, ng ating uh, chairperson si Ma'am Anigli Suarez ng uh, Philippine Association of Court Social Workers. Pero hindi ho magiging matagumpay ito kung wala ho ang iba't iba pong mga kasama. No ho. Dito ho yung uh, PASWI or ang Philippine Association of Social Workers Incorporated ang atin pong uh, NASWAY or ang National Association of Social Workers uh, Education no? Incorporated. Ang atin pong ALSUDOPI, ha? matagumpay din na nagdiriwang ng kanilang assembly. No? Mga dalawang linggo na po ang nakakalipas. Congratulations at maraming salamat sa inyong lahat. Ang atin pong uh, ADSWAY, siyempre hindi pwede makalimutan. No? yung atin pong Association of DSWD Social Workers Incorporated. No? At uh, syempre, marami pa rin po tayong mga kasamahan dito, yung atin pong AMSWAPI or ang Association of DS, uh, Medical Social Workers Incorporated. Ang atin pong DOH League, ha? DOH League, League of Social Workers no? sa Department of Health. At uh, syempre, ang atin pong mga kasama sa mga, na mga child experts, no? Tung mga child specialist, ha? mga kasama, uh, nandito ho yung Association of Child Caring Agencies of the Philippines and at the same time itong uh, uh, National Council on Social Development or NCSD. At siyempre, ang atin pong area-based standards network sa hanay po ng mga non-government organizations organized by DSWD. Na po? So, sampung mga organisasyon ho, malalaking organisasyon na kabahagi po o or membro nitong ASEAN Social Work uh, Consortium dito ho sa Pilipinas. Ayun ha. Yan. Pero bago ho tayo din magpatuloy, 
uh, ang PRC, ha? binabati ko ho ang mga taga PRC, PRB, no? Uh, mga PRB Board for Social Workers, no? Sila Doc uh, I mean, uh, uh, Ma'am Lor Nagabad, si uh, Doc Eli uh, uh, Acosta, no? And uh, si Ma'am Facingson, si uh, uh, ano nga ba pangalan nito? Si Ma'am Rosette Palma at marami pang iba, no? At batiin natin ang lahat ng mga social workers sa uh, corporate setting, no? Batiin na rin yung mga social workers diyan. Sa atin pong uh, 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 military, uh, PNP, other national government agencies, napakarami ho nito. At uh, marami pa pong iba. No? Um, dumadami na po ang atin pong mga social workers na naglilingkod sa iba't iba pong tanggapan, iba't iba pong ahensya ng ating pamahalan maging sa mga non-government organizations. Marami pong salamat sa inyo. No? At uh, siyempre, um, tayo po ngayon ay uh, magpasalamat kay uh, Doc Eli Acosta. No? Si Doc Eli Acosta po uh, nagkaroon po ng uh, isang proyekto ang uh, PRC. No? Ibahagi ho ng pagdiriwang ng uh, Professional Regulation Commission Anniversary. Ano po? At itong anniversary na ito ay meron po silang ginanap na tree planting. No, activity dito ho sa Jensen at ang four case po ay nakibahagi dito ho sa lugar ng uh, General Santos at marami hong dumalo ito hong mga dumalo dito ay mga social workers no ho kagaya ng Pasway no ho kagaya po ng uh, Nasway ng uh, court social workers at uh, syempre also Dopi no ho uh, marami po maraming dumalo dito sa ginanap na mango tree planting bahagi pa rin ho ito ng social workers day no ho na ginanap dito sa ating uh, buong uh, bansa at marami pa hong nagpapatuloy sa paggawa ho ng uh, mga aktibidades dahil hindi pa naman po natatapos ang buwan ng atin pong uh, karuan bilang mga manggagawang panlipunan so maraming maraming salamat po sa inyong lahat all right Um, hmm, mamaya ko na lang siguro ipakita yung maliit na video na ating pong uh, nakalap doon sa mango, uh, mangrove tree planting activity na dinalawon din natin ng uh, 4K edutainment at kasama din yung ating pong mga uh, social workers dito sa buong uh, Sarangani province ano po? and uh, Cotabato. Alright? Yun, magpapasalamat din ako kay... Uh, kay uh, sa executive director kay Ma'am Lisa ng uh, Mahintana Foundation no at the same time yung kay uh, 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 social work in uh, court setting diyan sa Pulomulok no si Ma'am Muher <laughs> Ma'am Muher ha ah, magandang gabi sa inyo lahat maraming salamat ho sa pag-assist sa atin dito sa atin pong uh, uh, pag-stay dito ho sa atin pong uh, uh, General Santos sa Glan at sa iba pa. No ho, maraming salamat din sa ating mga kasamahan diyan sa Region 12, sa Field Office 12 ng DSWD sa pag-coordinate, no ho, ng uh, atin pong mga uh, ilang kailangan habang tayo naririto. Maraming salamat po sa inyong lahat. At ngayon po, mga kasama, no ho, uh, atin pong uh, uh, bigyan ng pansin ang uh, pagbati sa mga nagdiriwang ng kanilang kaarawan or birthday celebration happy happy birthday sa inyo pong lahat and of course uh, sa mga nagdiriwang uh, ng uh, kanilang anibersaryo maraming salamat uh, happy anniversary sa inyong lahat at kung mayroon pa man pong ibang mga pinagdiriwang kayo na po ang magpatuloy sa inyong pagdiriwang at binabati na lamang po namin kayong lahat alright sa atin pong hanay ng uh, ng uh, viewers no at talagang challenge ngayon dahil uh, data at internet po ang ating uh, ginagamit no ho uh, balik na lamang po ang ating mga audience no at uh, marahil sila po ay nagagabihan ngayon so batiin ko lang po no ma'am Estela Lucy Armada she's watching live diyan sa Southern uh, Leyte no ho ma'am Tess Mamalyo Uh, Ma'am Teresita Teresa Javier. Ma'am Yofemia Robles, good evening, no? 
Yan sa Takurong City and uh, Ma'am Maricel Villesa, Joanna Shelabago, uh, Ed Spentinho. No, good evening sa inyong lahat from uh, CDW Taisan. Oy, Taisan. And Lalin Albino uh, and Eden Banggawan diyan sa Tanay. No, ho, magandang gabi po. Of course, masugid nating taga-panood, no? Ma'am Victoria Noble. No, ho? happy social workers day sa atin pong lahat. Oy, Exxon, no? Exxon. Eh, di, ba, di ba ikaw ay nasa Dole? So, baka sakali ay uh, maimbitahan ka rin namin dito, kayo ni Lapia, no? Ho? Para uh, maikwento natin yung atin pong mga uh, yung role ng mga social workers natin diyan sa Department of Labor and uh, Employment. And of course, magandang gabi ma'am, ARD, uh, Gemma Rivera. <laughs> yes ma'am, andito po ako sa inyo. <laughs> Ayan, Julie Arnigo, magandang gabi po. From San, from, uh, ano to? Taisan, Batangas. And ma'am Lucid, dyan sa Iloilo. Good evening. Alright, huwag na ho natin patagalin. Ngayong, <clears throat> ngayong gabi po, ang atin pong uh, panauhin ay hindi po bago dito sa poor case. Ito ho ay uh, pabalik-balik na po dito at uh, uh, patuloy ho natin siyang aanyayahan dahil nung tayo ay nagsisimula ho sa ating broadcast, inanyayahan natin siya dito lalong-lalo sa discussion nitong Mandanas. No? Kauna-unahan ho na inadvocate natin at dito lumabas ho dito sa poor case siyang uh, paghahanda no? sa ating Mandanas sa uh, ruling o itong second devolution uh, 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 preparation no ho, na ongoing naman na siya ngayon. At uh, yung ilan pong mga updates, naging kasabay niya ho dito ang author mismo ng Mandanas Law, no ho, si Governor Dudo Mandanas, no ho, dyan ho sa Batangas. No ho, siya po ang pangunahing author nito. Ano? At uh, sa pang pangatlong pagkakataon, naanyayahan din uli natin siya dito para ibahagi ang ilang mga updates. At ngayon, siya po ay magbabalik live dito ho sa atin dahil dito ho ibabahagi naman ho niya sa atin ang napakaganda pong pag-uusapan natin ngayon. Ito ay may kinalaman sa ASEAN Social Work uh, uh, Strengthening ng uh, profession o itong tinatawag natin na roadmap ng atin pong mga social workers hindi lang dito sa Pilipinas kundi sa buong ASEAN. Siya po ang uh, kasalukuyang uh, undersecretary for standards and capacity building group at the same time siya po ang uh, kasalukuyang uh, sumswad uh, focal uh, person. Walang iba po ang atin pong undersecretary undersecretary uh, Joyce Niwani ng DSWD. Magandang gabi po sa iyo Ma'am Joyce. Oy, Ma'am Joyce, yan, Asik, uh, Yosik Joyce, magandang gabi po. Naka, yan, yan. Magandang Ayan. gabi din. Naririnig ba ako? Opo, naririnig po. Yan, naririnig? Opo, opo ah, okay. ma'am. <laughs> gandang gabi sa... Okay. Magandang gabi sa iyo, Sir Ricky, sa lahat ng uh, 4Ks na mga kasamahan natin na nakikinig at nag, uh, nanonood sa kanilang Facebook Live. Uh, of course, uh, since nandyan ka sa Jensen, magandang gabi sa lahat ng mga taga Jensen at Region 12. Uh, lahat ng mga kasamahan natin na social workers at of course yung ating mga partners na nakikinig ngayong gabi. So, nawawala ata sila Kuya Jess at saka si Nico. Anyway. <laughs> <laughs> Hindi pa naman po. Represent na ba? Magpre-present pa, na ba ako? Uh, Mamaya-maya lamang pa, po. Okay. Ayan, okay lang yung title po, no? Okay, atin pong okay. Uh, bigyan ng uh, pagbati ang uh, napakabait at napakasipag ding uh, undersecretary, former undersecretary ng DSWD, Yusek uh, Flor Rubiano Villar. Magandang gabi po sa iyo, Ma'am uh, Yusek Flor. Uh, sana po ay mapaunlakan nyo kami dito sa ating pong 4K at nang mapanood naman po ang inyong pong mga napakagandang mayabong nakaranasan uh, bilang manggagawang panlipunan. And of course sa ating Vice President ng, oy hindi pala Vice, ano, kundi ito ay uh, President ng uh, ADSWI dyan po sa Region 3, ha? President 
ARD Maribel Blanco, good evening. And uh, ayun, oo. Maraming salamat sa inyong uh, pagdalo uh, at panonood. I-share po natin ito ho kasi minsan lamang ho itong uh, pag-usapan although ito naman po ay uh, uh, naibahagi na during that time na tayo ay nagdiriwang ng uh, uh, atin pong kaarawan ano last uh, June 19 pero mas maganda ho na atin po itong maipaunawa at ituloy ho natin ang pagpapa uh, ang pagpo-promote nito no yung roadmap okay ma'am Joyce <coughs> iona po natin yung camera kumusta po si ma'am Joyce ngayon busy po ba sa transition <laughs> yeah, salamat. <laughs> Oo, busy tayo sa transition pero okay pa rin. <laughs> Oo. Ma'am, uh, may share mo lang ng uh, konti bago natin pasadahan ng ating roadmap. Ano ho ba ang mga paghahanda ngayon sa atin pong departamento lalo na lalo na malapit na hong uh, pumasok ang uh, incoming uh, secretary at malapit na rin namang magtapos ang ating outgoing secretary uh, uh, secretary Rolly Bautista. Ah, oo. Actually, may ginawa ang uh, department natin sa uh, the leadership of uh, Secretary Rolly uh, yung ating transition plan para sa next administration. So, we nag-brief, meron mga briefings sa uh, mga madami na rin ang briefings natin since uh, two weeks ago. So, ongoing pa rin ang briefings and um, yung ating uh, Kalihim na papasok si incoming Secretary Erwin Tulfo has been going around even sa regional level. In fact, this uh, week since uh, Thursday, Friday, Saturday, nandun siya sa Luzon Cluster. So lahat po ng ating mga regional directors ay uh, nakakasalamuhan na rin ng ating incoming uh, administration. At... Uh, mga dito naman sa central office uh, per cluster ng uh, ay binisita na rin niya at na brief na rin yung ating mga bagong team na papasok in fact meron ulit i think sa monday for gas g for another briefing so ongoing lahat ito and we have uh, prepared a handbook ng transition plan handbook That will be handover during the turnover ceremony, sa June 30, between our outgoing secretary Rolando Hasalito de Liso Bautista and the incoming secretary Erwin Tolfo. So, yam po ang magaganap sa 30th. Ilang araw na lang, magkakaroon na tayo ng ibang administration. So, yun ang right. mga preparations na ginagawa natin ngayon. Okay. Talaga namang napakadami ng uh, uh, paghahanda ng ating uh, departamento at uh, maging ang ating kaming uh, uh, ano uh, secretary at ang kanya pong mga entourage no? ay uh, mukhang naghahanda na rin. Kaya lang uh, mukhang hindi pa nababanggit ang mga pangalan nitong uh, mga bagong papasok sa atin no na mga kasamahan ni uh, incoming secretary uh, Erwin Tulfo pero uh, siguro bahagi ng paghahanda ay mag-ikot no ang atin pong uh, incoming secretary at parang napansin ko ngayon ho ay nasa Visayas region no at uh, kausap ang uh, sinasabi nila ng uh, Tres Marias ng <laughs> ng uh, region no sila director maka uh, pobre Of course si uh, uh, itong director natin sa Region 8 no at saka sa dire, uh, Region uh, 7. Uh, ano ho kaya ang mga uh, proposed uh, uh, program ng atin pong kalihim may nababanggit na po sila uh, sa inyo Yusek? Uh, wala pa ang sabi lang nila is uh, they are reviewing lahat yung ating mga naibigay sa kanila uh, We believe naman na they will, they are studying it and um, meron naman sila sinasabi that they will support the uh, good practices and of course the good programs that are already in place. So we are trusting na uh, this will happen kahit naman yung support nila sa social work, yung pinag-usapan nung unang briefing, 
ay uh, uh, mukhang malinaw naman na uh, susuportahan ang social work profession. So we hope na uh, we're looking forward sa next administration. Uh, tama, nandun sila talaga sa, sa Cebu, sa Region 7 uh, since Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday. I think pauwi na sila ngayong Saturday. <laughs> uh, so nag-init nila yung tatlong Tres Marias. Uh, nagkataon na nagkasabay nga kami. So tama ka. Uh, oh, tama. Maganda na maata ang usapan nila. <laughs> oh, 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 oh. Maganda ho yun. At isang uh, maganda rin yung paghahanda para mapamilyarize ho ang ating uh, incoming secretary at ang kanya pong mga kasama para sa iba't ibang mga regional offices kasi Hindi naman ho ng lahat ng regional offices ay magkakapariho ng mga ginagalawan. Pariho ang mandato pero may magkakaiba. May pagkakaiba talaga. Lalong-lalo sa laki, uh, sa mga ginagawa. No? May mega regions. Mayroon namang mga uh, uh, hindi ganun kalakihang rehiyon. Pero marami ding mga challenges. I, I, I think uh, mukhang binisita ho ng ating incoming secretary ang ating pong, uh, uh, malaking warehouse dito sa Cebu. No, uh, siguro bahagi ito ng kanyang paghahanda uh, kung sa kasakali ho at may mga malaking challenge in the future ay sabi niya nga po di ba? ang mabilis wala pa labing dalawang oras ay nandun na ho siya sa ground at ang assistance ay nandun na ho sa ground so malalaman ho natin yan uh, pag dumating yung panahon na siya po ay nandiyan dyan at uh, magbibigay ho siya ng mga direktiba para sa mga social workers and development workers. Ang isang nakakatuwa ho dito at nakakataba ng puso na nauna na ho niyang pinaliwanag at uh, sinabi na uh, susuportahan niya po ang mga social workers, lalong-lalo na yung uh, iba't ibang mga yung matatagal na ho dyan, no sa tanggapan ay napakagandang hakbang ho yan para sa mga social workers and development workers na makilala, kilalanin ang kanilang mga kaalaman at naging uh, practice, contribution Habang uh, matagal na silang naglilingkod dyan sa tanggapan. Isa po, ano? pag ganyan ho, uh, Secretary Erwin Tolfo, ang inyo pong gawin ay susuporta ho ang bawat isang manggagawa sa, atin pong, sa inyong pamunuan. Kagaya din po ng pagsuporta sa mga nakaraang administrasyon ng DSW. Di ba, uh, Yusik Joyce? Tama, uh, uh, Sir Ricky. Totoo yan, uh, ang social workers ay lagi namang handa na uh, humarap at uh, laging makiisa kung sino man yung uh, uh, pinono o kaya leader ng ating uh, departamento. Um, lahat naman, halos lahat ng uh, mga leaders na, na, pag, uh, na dumaan sa departamento ay um, laging sumusuporta ang ating mga social workers sa pag uh, pag uh, sigurado na lahat ng mga programa ng para sa ating mga disadvantaged and uh, vulnerable groups ay naibibigay. So, walang problema si Secretary Tulfo sa pakikipag-isa at pakikikooperate sa ng ating mga social workers. Yeah. Yan naman ay ating skill. Yes. Yan. Oh, at saka yan naman ang ating uh, talagang uh, minimithi na sino man na umupo sa tanggapan, magkaiba man ng uh, kulay at paniniwala, basta isa ang uh, paninindigan, sangayon sa paninindigan ng departamento, ay hindi naman magkakalayo at magtutulong-tulong ang bawat isa dyan. No? Uh, yung atin naman pong uh, kalihim uh, secretary role, hindi pa naman ho siya talagang nag umaalis at nandyan pa at bising-bisi din ho, kagaya ni Pangulong uh, Rodrigo Duterte, ay uh, nag-inaugurate din itong uh, bagong uh, tren ha papuntang Bicol ha Yosek Joyce itong uh, uh, tren na mula dyan sa San Pablo papunta ng Lucena yan pala ay papunta ng uh, Bicol no sa Daraga iyong dating 10 oras na byahe o kung ikaw ay naka private vehicle at kung ikaw naman ay public uh, bus transportation ang uh, labing dalawang oras na byahe aba Kanina ho, napanood ko at tuwang-tuwa ho ako dahil bihira ako makauwi ng Bicol. Ngayon siguro dadalasan ko na baka linggo-linggo umuwi na ho ako diyan sa amin, no? At uh, magbakasyon dahil ang sabi doon sa anunsyo, 
ay uh, 3.5 hours na lang, 3 and a half hours mula dyan sa San Pablo hanggang doon sa Daraga, uh, sa Albay. At uh, kung medyo titigil dyan, siyempre ng mga estasyon, aabot ho yan ng mga limang oras. Ay, mainam pa rin yun, Yosik Joyce. No? Kasi pina, pinadali ang uh, travel period na hindi na magtatagal. So napakaganda yan na uh, parang legacy ng atin pong uh, Pangulo yeah. sa larangan po ng transportation na system. Ano po? At ang atin namang kalihim, yeah, magaling. Oo, kalihim Secretary Rolly, ang kanya namang hong, uh, isa, isa sa mga pinapamalas ngayon, itong pagkakaroon uh, nitong uh, 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 operation center or itong agency operation center na lahat ng region so ay mayroon na para mabilis so ang komunikasyon, mabilis so ang, uh, ang pag pagkuha ng data, yung decision making, lalong lalo na kapag may mga pangangailangan. So magtatagpo-tagpo ang bawat region no, sa atin pong sinasabi na uh, uh, ROC o ito ng regional operation center na ang counterpart sa central office ay itong uh, National Operation Center, NOC, sa region ROC. So imagine niyo ho yan, ang repository lahat ng mga datos na yan, pag nagkaroon uh, ng, uh, ng pag-uusap, ay talagang napakaganda kasi ora mismo makakapag-design. At iyan po ang isang uh, legasya ho na ating uh, kalihim sa marami pang ibang mga ginawa niya rin po. Ano? And, uh, and siyempre, yung ating uh, mamanahin ng ating incoming Secretary Erwin Tolpo. No, Sir Erwin, sama-sama ah, tayo diyan sa ating DSWD. All right. <laughs> Yosek, no? Ah, uh, yun para oh, para napakaganda, no? Totoo 'yan, Ricky. Tayo ay uh, masaya at uh, meron tayong AOC na uh, ito yung mga ina-inaugurate lahat hal sa lahat ng uh, regions eh meron na established. Alam ko sa sa region 4 maganda yung inyo. So ganun din sa mga iba't ibang uh, rehiyon ay katatapos yung iba last week ng kanilang mga inaugurasyon at uh, ito ay talaga makakatulong sa yes. at nakita rin ni Secretary Tulfo yung mga AOC specialist sa Central Office. Yun yung hmm. unang binisita niya pag uh, first ng kanyang first briefing natin mm -hmm. sa kanya yeah mm -hmm. so uh -huh. na appreciate naman niya yon wow. tama yon ang magiging legacy ni uh, Sir Rolly alam uh -huh. naman natin na marami marami ding uh, sakripisyo at ginawa ang ating yes. uh, current kalihim sa ating uh, uh -huh. secretary uh, tama po yan Yosik Joyce kasi sa Monday sa Lunes no ho? Siya po ang ating pong kalihim, uh, Secretary Rolly Bautista, ay nasa Region 4 po. Dahil uh, dito rin namin bubuksan ang ating pong uh, ROC or ang AOC, Operation Center ng DSWD Field Office 4A. Ito ho, Ma'am Joyce, ay uh, una kong uh, uh, isinama ko din ho sa aking uh, uh, 25 priority trust or uh, uh, trust ng uh, uh, 4A nung ako po ay nalipat sa Disaster uh, Response Management uh, Division uh, taong 2018. At sabi ko maganda ito na i-prioritize. Kaya lang that time walang budget ang, uh, ang atin pong region dahil capital outlay. At ngayon lamang ho yan na materialize last year at ngayon ho matapos na at siya ngayon ay buo na. Kaya uh, ang tabayanan ho natin ang paglulunsad ng uh, DSWD Calabarzon Agency Operation Center Makakasama ho natin dyan yung iba po nating mga uh, bigatin <laughs> na inyayahang uh, mga kasamahan both from uh, insider and uh, the exter external partner ng uh, department. Alright, so mukhang napakadami na ng ating uh, pinag-usapan patungkol sa, sa mga updates. No? Uh, ngayon, uh, pag-usapan ho siguro natin itong... Uh, ASEAN uh, social workers uh, social uh, workers uh, roadmap uh, bago ni Yosek i-present ito uh, Yosek brief lang paano ho ba nagkaroon ng uh, pagbubuo no briefing lang ito bago i-present yung detalye paano ho nagsimula itong idea idea lang no na mabuo itong uh, tinatawag nating roadmap ng mga social workers sa buong uh, ASEAN Ah, oo. Actually, um, nung 
ten yung pag uh, dito di, di ba dito ginanap yung ASEAN summit so dito inumpisahan ng ating mga uh, dating mga kalihi dating mga kasama kagaya ni Yusek uh, Villar sila yung nagumpisa na introduce ang uh, sana magkaroon ng ASEAN ng isang pagtingin sa ating social workers at uh, i-appreciate kung ano talaga ang profession ng social work. So dito nag-umpisa yung mga uh, lobbying kung paano ito maging isang uh, consortium. So dito nag-umpisa sa Pilipinas. So tayo ang nag-host niyan. So pasalamat tayo sa mga uh, nauna ng mga social workers natin at mga SAM squad na nag-handle nito. Kaya dahil dito, tinanggap ng uh, ASEAN ang uh, consortium so nagbuo ng ASEAN Social Work Consortium at uh, ni start na gumawa din ng isang roadmap after nung 2019 so kasama kami doon ni Kuya Jess, si uh, Ma'am Melba as representative ng NASWI at si Ani as representative ng Alswadopi so doon nagumpisa in introduce yung uh, uh, ASEAN Uh, Hanoi Declaration. Kaya sa Hanoi, kasi sa Hanoi, Vietnam ang nag-host ng unang-unang pag-isip ng uh, paggawa ng roadmap para sa profesyon ng social work at ang kanyang so sir, social work, sir, uh, workforce. So ganyan ang nangyari. So yan, ngayon uh, na-approve na yung ating uh, roadmap. So kaya pwede na natin siyang i-share. Yeah. But uh, yung ating ding Philippine Social Work Consortium ay nabuo. Yun yung gusto kong i-highlight mamaya sa aking sharing. Uh, at yung ginagawa natin for the Philippines, especially for the roadmap din ng DSWD per se. Ayan. Uh, yun. <laughs> mm-hmm. <laughs> Ganon yeah, ang yeah. ating kwento. Kaya yeah. salamat tayo kina Yusek Villar at lahat ng mga tumulong para mag- mabuo at makilala ang social work as a profession sa ASEAN. Alright, okay, 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 very good. Okay, uh, maraming salamat for that introductory note, uh, Yusek Joyce. At ngayon po, andito na po ang atin pong uh, co-host. No? Ang pinakagwapo. Yan, pinakagwapo sa 4 days. <laughs> Ah, uh, Kuya Jasper, kumusta kayo? Tika mo na, bok mukhang uh... Tika mo na, Kuya Jess, mukhang uh, grabe. Ay, si sobrang traffic. Oo, okay. Nasa biyahe ka pa ba ngayon o nasa No testing, testing. Ha? Nako, nawawala ho ang signal nyo, Kuya Jess. Hello. Ay, nawawala ang signal nyo, Kuya Jess. Napaka-traffic. Eh? Nasa, nasa na ako. Nasa, nasa bahay na. <laughs> sorry, eh. sorry, sorry. Man, okay lang. No problem. No worries. No worries. No worries. Okay. So, sige lang. Uh, mukhang uh, ang audio ng ating kapatid na Kuya Jess Parr ay medyo nagpa-fluctuate. Pero sige lang, Kuya Jess. No? Andyan ka naman. Uh, nakikita kita. Pero kung uh, mahina ang signal, pwede naman off cam pero nakikinig at pwede ka naman makapagtanong kasi minsan pag naka-on ang camera, kumakain ang bandwidth. Uh, 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 uh. Sige lang. Pero si uh, Yusek Joyce, no? Ay atin siyang uh, uh, kakapanawin, kakapanayamin ngayon. Uh, Kuya Jess, no? Uh, pero bago natin ituloy kay uh, Ma'am uh, Yusek Uh, mayroon ho tayong inanyayahan na mga singers dito sa 4K atin na lang siguro muna pakantahin para derderitso ang ating pakikipagpintuhan kay atin pong uh, Joyce Niwani na siya pong magdi-discuss ng detalyado klarado para sa ating mga tagapanood ito pong atin pong uh, ASEAN Social Work Roadmap okay? Samir atin pong uh, Unahin ang atin pong uh, kanina pang naghihintay, no? Ang atin pong uh, batikang singer ng 4Ks, 
at Batikang Senior ng DSWD, si Mr. Samir Manzanilla, at uh, hindi ko mahanap yung isa pong uh, nasend sa akin na audio, video mula sa ating isa pang singer. Samir? Hi, Sir Jess. Hi, Sir Ricky. And of course, uh, to you, Sir uh, Joyce. Hi, ma'am. Okay. Yo, amigo. Uh, Samir, matagal Hello, namin ikaw. Hello, Samir. Uh, Oh, matagal na ba ito? Uh, hindi nakasama dito ha, Samir. Oo oh, hmm. nga, sir. Oh. <laughs> Mahirap pa lang mag-aral, sir. Oh. Hello, sir. Ko ba ako. Oh. Hello, sir Jess. Okay. Una-una, binabati ko po lahat ng mga nanonood po sa ating show sa 4Ks. Namiss ko po kayong lahat. <laughs> Siyempre, um, binabati ko po ang nag-iisang social worker and secretary ng DSWD, USEC Choice. Mm-hmm. Hi, ma'am. So I dedicate this song sa lahat ng ating viewers at para kay Yusek Joyce. Okay. Yes, sir. Thank you. Day after day, I must face a world of strangers where I don't belong. I'm not that strong It's nice to know That there's someone I can turn to Who will always care You're always there When there's no getting over that rainbow When my smallest of dreams won't come True, I can take all the madness the world has to give, but I won't last a day without you. So many times when the city seems to be without a friendly friend. A lonely place It's nice to know That you'll be there if I need you And you'll always smile It's so worthwhile When there's no getting over that rainbow When my smallest of dreams won't come True, I can take all the madness the world has to give, but I won't stay without you. Touch me and I end up singing. Trouble seems to open, disappear. You touch me with the love you bring in. I can really lose when you're near. When you're near, my love and all my friends, I've forgotten half the promises. They're not in kind, just hard to find. One look at you and I know that I could learn to live without the rest. I found the best when there's no getting over that rainbow. When there's more and the dreams won't come true. I can tell. All the madness the world has to give, but I won't stay without you. When there's no getting over that rainbow, when my smallest of dreams won't come true, I can take all the madness. The world has to give, but I won't last a day without you. You. Uh. 
without you. Maraming salamat po, Yusek Joyce. That's for you and sa lahat po ng ating mga viewers. Okay, maraming maraming salamat thank sa iyo. Thank you very much, Samir. Oh, uh, Samir, ma Thank you, thank you, Samir. Oh, ang ganda ng uh, boses talaga nitong si Samir, no? Walang kupas talaga kaya. Uh, Samir, malapit ka nang ma-discover, malapit ka na mag-appear sa TV. <laughs> ah, Samir. <laughs> oh, abangan natin 'yan. Ano, uh, show. Ma-discover ka baka sa kay Kuya FTV, Win. Sir, FTV. Oh, Kuya Erwin Tulpo. <laughs> okay, Kuya Jess. Yes, Yaman sir. lang din. Kanina, na binabanggit ko yung uh, uh, ating uh, mango tree planting. Ano, uh, mang, ano to? Mangrove tree planting na ginanap dito sa Jensen kasama yung PRC-PRB board. Uh, uh, to give uh, credit ano, at pagpapasalamat na rin at uh, na-commit natin na ipanood sa, sa lahat yung nangyari ditong uh, pagtatanim. Yes, yes. Pangunguna ni Dr. Kelly Acosta. Uh, painumin mo na si Yusek ng uh, tubig. Baka nauhaw. <laughs> Habang <laughs> 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 uh, ipapalabas lang po natin ito. No? At pagkatapos nito, ibibigay na po natin si Yusek uh, ni Wani. Alright. Hanggang 4 days po, entertainment ay nakikita dito. Ayan. Nandito na si uh, Doc Nelly. Ayan. Doc Nelly, magandang hapon. Good afternoon. Hello. Oh, say hello. Ano po ang uh, layunin ng activity? Magandang pre-planting itong group of uh, pastries and uh, from the different schools of uh, teachers and uh, students uh, from Jensen University. This I initiated being part of the social movement and the Filipino social movement yesterday. Yes, yes, yes. Uh, congratulations, Kukili. Ang magsimbi ay walang kapatay. Karapat ang pantao ay ating kagandaan. Pagkaptan lamang ang tunay na katarungan. Sa bayang Pilipinas na aming minamahal. Provision namin ay handa. Tinataas namin ang kapatan. Kababaihan man ay ginagalang. Kalalakihan din may pakialam na makamtan ang kaunlaran. Kinikilala may kapaysanan, lulus-lula ay tinutulungan. Ang LGBTQ ay kasamaan, katutubo ay aking pakinggan. Say hi! Karapat ang matao ay aming pinaglalaban Makamtan lamang ang tunay na katarungan Sa bayang Pilipinas na aming pinamahal Provision namin ay handang iyan Dito mas halikod ang iba, hindi ewan makuha tira Dito mas halikod ang iba, hindi ewan makuha tira Sige na, happy social workers day! Say hi! Gawang panlipunan Ating Wow Beautiful Secretary, Bagi-bagi pagsubok, Mga sulirani, Bagi-bagi pagsubok, Beautiful Secretary, Vulcanic is a Marawis is Pantina, COVID-19, Kaya natin, Kaya natin, Itong lahat, Kailangan natin ang Talino at yaman, Kaya natin ang mga estudyante ng iba't ibang universitas dito sa Jensen. 
Ako ikaw sila tayo lahat Pilipino Kulay kayo man di makagyos at makatao okay, man, Isang man. ugo, isang bansa, isang bandila Uwa! Kaya natin, kaya natin itong lahat Uwoh! Magbayanihan at magkaisa sa kaunlaran Alright, maraming maraming salamat po sa atin pong PRC PRB Board sa pangunguna ni Doc Eli Acosta. Maraming salamat po sa inyo Doc Eli at ang iba pang mga nakilahok dito sa ating mango tree planting activity uh, sa pagdiriwang ng atin pong ikatatlong anibersaryo ng mga manggagawang Pilipino Social Workers. <laughs> Manggagawa ang uh, Pilipino Social Workers Day pala, Kuya Jess. Maraming salamat po, okay. Kuya Jess. <clears throat> yes, sir. Okay. Ngayon naririnig po, na ako, sir. Yes, sir. Naririnig na po kayo, sir, uh, Jess. Okay? Oo. Oh. Uh, bumati pwede, ka muna, Kuya. Pwede ba natin, pwede ba natin i-advocate? Yes, sir. Uh, good evening sa lahat. Uh, pwede ba natin i-advocate lahat ng mga social work groups sa Pilipinas Uh, gawin natin all year round yung tree planting. Tapos i-feature natin sa 4Ks yung mga grupo nila. Yes. Pwede ba yan? Yes, oo, oo. In fact, yun na po ang naging plano na atin pong representative sa PRC-PRB uh -huh. na nationwide na po ito tuwing celebration ng ating Social Work Day uh -huh. ay uh, yung week long o kaya yung month long na yan ay magkakaroon ng iba't ibang mga aktividades sa atin pong mga social workers sa buong Pilipinas na sasamahan din ng iba't iba pong mga yeah. organisasyon ng mga social workers in the respective local, provincial uh, coverage sa Kuya Jess. Yes. Ayan. Oo. At ngayon? Yes. Oo. Oh, Ikanis natin lahat. You all year round. Tapos ibipidyo natin sa 4 case. Yes, mm. sir. Kasi Kuya Jess, alam mo kung maaalala mo, yung World Celebration, uh, World Social Work Day, ang pinopromote doon ay karamihan <laughs> environmental protection, yes. human relationship, no? uh, yes. uh, ano pa ba yun? Uh, yan, yung climate change. So, why not? Total uh, world ang nag adapt noon at nagpo-promote at ang Pilipinas naman ay nakikiisa doon sa ating lokal na sagdiriwang, edi eh, isama na natin din yung mga ganong mga advokasya, Kuya Jess. Yes, yeah, tama yan. Yes. Okay. I-promote natin yung uh -oh. climate uh, support to climate change. Mm -hmm. Na yan. Land, sige please. Oo, oh, oh. oh, sige nga. Pakilike nga dyan sa atin pong mga taga-panood kung okay sa inyo ito na ating uh, gagawin na siyang uh, nationwide. No? Nationwide. Ito pong uh, naumpisahan na Uh, tree planting activity ng mga social workers naman ang nangunguna rito. Right? Like, like. Mm. Mm, ayos. Parang uh, ayan. Siguro uh, bigay na natin kay uh, Asik Joyce. Ayosik Joyce ang uh, lahat ng mga magagandang uh, uh, discussion dito sa ating uh, 
ASEAN Roadmap, Kuya Jess. At pakinggan po yes. natin siya, ibigay ho sa kanyang oras at panoorin ho ninyo lahat at ishare ninyo ho ito dahil dito lang po sa forecast ninyo ito mapapakinggang roadmap ng mga social workers sa yes. buong ASEAN. Ma'am, Yosek, go ahead. Yosek, go. Okay. Okay, thank you very much, uh, Sir Jess and Sir yes, Ricky. Yosek. Thank you. And uh, congratulations sa ating mga social workers, lalo na yung mga nag-tree planting na sa mangrove. Talagang ganda naman ang saya at tama, sinabi nyo. Uh, sana ay uh, maging year-round ito. At uh, salamat din sa pag-unlock uh, uh, pag sa amin para ma-share natin ang roadmap. Uh, tonight, we will focus more on the draft roadmap ng DSWD in the implementation of the Hanoi Declaration. Kasi diba, nung, 20, nung 19 June, diniscuss natin in toto yung uh, ASEAN Social Work Roadmap. So ngayon, uh, pasadahan natin pa rin, pero we will have uh, some portion yung pinopopros natin na roadmap din ng DSWD in the implementation of the Hanoi Declaration naman. Para sa ganon ma kita at maintindihan uh, ito at pwede natin siyang uh, pag-usapan kung ito ay uh, pwedeng gawin o kaya lahat ba sa atin, lahat, lalo na yung consortium ng uh, uh, Philippines, ASEAN Social, uh, ASEAN Social Work Consortium ng Philippines will support all of this. So allow me to discuss with you Uh, the DSWD proposed roadmap on the implementation of the Hanoi. Uh, sandali lang nga. Pwedeng i-off ko na lang yung camera para siguradong hindi ako ma-chop-chop. Choppy-choppy. Is that okay? Okay lang ba? Sige ma'am. Okay lang po. Yes, you said okay. Okay. Kasi nag-fluctuate ang uh, Wi-Fi natin eh. Okay, thank you. So... Looking at the screen, ang title natin dito is uh, the DSWD um, Roadmap on the Implementation of the Hanoi Declaration on Strengthening Social Work. Um, however, before that, we would like to review. Alam ko na this is uh, already, dapat ito ay nasa puso natin lahat at alam natin. Kaya lang para tayo ay uh, pare-pareho ang definition ng social work at ito din ang naging uh, definition na rin ng ating ASEAN Social Work Consortium ay uh, mapag uh, tama natin lahat na ito yung ating gustong magiging definition. So, ang social work accordingly, so I invite everyone to look at the uh, screen, social work profession which is primarily concerned with organized social service activity aimed to facilitate and strengthen basic social relationships uh, with emphasis social relationships and the mutual adjustment between individuals and their social environment for the good of the individual and of by of, of course society by the use of social work methods so according to RA 4373 so ito po yung ating definition dito sa Pilipinas kung ano po ang social work next slide please ang sumunod is uh, first what is social ano yung social okay so yan yung social work ito naman yung Social worker. So ano ba ang social worker? So ang social worker ay isang practitioner who by accepted academic training and social work professional experience possesses the skill to achieve the objectives as defined and set by the social work profession through the use of the basic methods and techniques of social work number one case work group work and community organization which are designed to enable 
individuals, groups, and communities to meet their needs and to solve the problems of adjustment to a hanging pattern of society and through coordinated action to improve economic and social conditions and is connected with an organized social work agency which is supported partially or wholly from government or community solicited funds. RA, that is from our RA 47, 43, 40, 70. Next slide. So the social worker, as mentioned earlier, is already as defined. Now, let's define social service workforce. A wide range of governmental and non-governmental professionals and para-professionals and community level volunteers who work with children, youth, adult women and men, older persons, families and communities focusing on those with additional needs who are marginalized in vulnerable situations or at risk to protect and ensure their healthy development and well being and the fulfillment of their rights. To do so, the social service workforce provides preventive, responsive, and promotive services that are informed by the humanities and social services, indigenous knowledge, discipline specific and interdisciplinary knowledge and skills, and ethical principles. Social service workers engage people, structures, and organizations to facilitate access to needed services, alleviate poverty, challenge and reduce discrimination and social isolation, promote social justice and human rights, and prevent and respond to violence, abuse, exploitation, neglect, and family separation. This is from the Hanoi Declaration on Social Work. So this is the definition that the uh, ASEAN Social Work Consortium adopted. So I would like to share this so that we will be able to have the same mindset as we discuss uh, what is the uh, social service workforce and what is the social work profession that we are supposed to promote. So this time, I would like also to emphasize, the, uh, as discussed many times already, um, in the uh, in last twin, in last June seven, June nineteen, yung ating mismong Filipino Social Work Day, and other fora that we have been discussing. What is the ASEAN Social Work Consortium? Pero the next slide we will be discussing the Philippines, the ASWC muna. Kasi kailangan, na-discuss ko na ito during the June 19, pero it is, I feel that this should be fully understood and appreciated by all social workers that uh, the Philippines has a very strong ASEAN Social Work Consortium. So, the establishment of the ASEAN Social Work Consortium here in the Philippines or was already formerly Philipp known as the Philippine Social Work Consortium. This is to respond to the commitment to establish national social work consortium among each of the 10 ASEAN member states. The Philippines through NASWE in coordination with DSWD as the Philippine SAMSWAD country coordinator and in partnership with various social work associations in the Philippines held the Philippine Social Work Consortium conference last October 2011 at the Quezon City Hall sponsored by the Quezon City government through coordinated efforts of the ALSWADOPI. So the conference provided a venue where the various organizations were able to level off and identify points of convergence. So doon po nag-umpisa yung ating 
Social Work Consortium, Consortium Philippines. Next slide. The social work in the Philippines is being championed by various social work professional associations in different settings following the first social work consortium conference in 2011 the philippines established a national mechanism or coordination and organization of the different social work associations to implement philippine commitments to the asean social work consortium shown in the slides are the national associations of social workers in the philippines with their logo or their branding so the philippine association of social workers or incorporated or PASWI, the association of social work social welfare and development officers of the philippines incorporated the national association for social work education incorporated or NASWI, association of local social welfare and development officers of the Philippines Incorporated or ALSWADOPI, Philippine Association of Court Social Workers Incorporated or PAXWI, Association of Medical Social Workers, AMSWI, Association of Child Caring Agencies of the Philippines, ACAP, National Council of Social Development, NCSD, Development of Health League of Medical Social Workers, Association of the SWD Social Workers Incorporated, or ADSWI, and of course, the ABSNET. Each operates along parallel lines that come sometimes converge during national conferences or during PASWI biennial conventions, just like the celebration of the National or Filipino Social Workers Day and other activities wherein all of the different associations converge to be able to come up with one program or a project in, on that matter. So the next slide will show you. Next slide, please. Next slide, there. If you notice the uh, people on this uh, picture, you can see uh, Yusek Villar, tama? So the vision of the ASWC Philippines is to strengthen solidarity among social work prof practitioners and educators and schools of social work. So this is to promote and institutionalize effective collaboration work towards greater support from policymakers and formal recognition enhancement of the social work profession, establish and continuously enhance core competencies and ethical standards of social work education, and share experience and resources, and promote networking. So ito po yung ating gustong mangyari. So we have a covenant. This reflects the vision of the ASEAN Social Work Consortium towards the advancement of social work practice, education in each ASEAN member states and in the region. Next slide. Social work pra pra part partnerships, networking and collaboration uh, is necessary. So we have to have interagency collaboration, which is government to government, partnerships with local and international CSOs and private sectors, and membership to international organizations on social work practice and education. This is the participation of the ASWC and memorandum of cooperation with other countries on education and social welfare. Example, exchange program with Russia, Japan, South Korea, Euro-Asia, and others. And of course, establishing and further strengthening the National Social Work Consortium, sustaining of various social work associations in the Philippines. Next slide. The PSWC 
serve as an important venue for sustained contributions of various social work associations in promotion of social work practice and education. It also paved the way for the development and implementation of action points in relation to the crafting of the global agenda for social work and social development and other common concerns. The PSWC also coordinated for the conduct of Social Work Day held last 28 June 2014 in UPCSWCD, Deliman, Quezon City, with the theme, Changes and Challenges, the Social Work Profession at 50 plus one. Next slide. At the ASEAN, the Philippine Social Work Consortium's sustained substantive contributions were instrumental to the development and accomplishment of the following key deliverables and commitments of the Philippines to the ASEAN Social Work Consortium. The ASEAN Social Work Code of Ethics was uh, where the social workers from the Philippines have really done a lot here. ASEAN guidelines for the selection of the ASWC pool of experts, and of course, the ASWC website. So the Philippine Social Work Consortium also takes the lead in the development and eventual finalization of the ASEAN minimum standard and core curriculum for social work education. So we should appreciate really our ASWC Philippines for they have done a lot. So for this, the CAPA capability building activity on social work case management, social work practice and competencies of social workers. This is a response to high number of cases being handled by social workers, specifically along survivors of violence against women and their children, abused children, cases of children who use drugs, among others, celebrated the Philippine Social Workers Day last June 19, 2020, through a press release and video message of the Secretary Rolando Joselito Bautista. And the third is Directory of ASEAN Social Work Consortium Philippines. So yan po yung ating mga uh, achievements. Next slide. Following the conduct of the first ASEAN Social Work Conference, the Philippines has consistently maintained the development and strengthening of a national mechanism of coordination and organization through the Philippine Social Work Consortium, ensuring that the Philippines is contributing to the implementation of the ASWC work plan. With the establishment of the Philippine Social Work Consortium in 2011, the Philippines was able to successfully formalize the partnership of national social work organizations, agencies for a more effective coordinated and strategic response to professional and developmental issues and concerns of social work in the country. Next slide. In this next slide, you will uh, recognize some personalities here in the picture. So as part of its advocacy, the Philippine Social Work Consortium or the ASWC Philippines is initiating and promoting the celebration of Social Workers Day every 19th June, which we just had uh, uh, last week, recognizing the hard work and commitment of our social workers in serving the Filipino people and in bringing about societal change. The date is in accordance to the date of approval of the Republic Act 4373 or an act to regulate the practice of social work and the operation of social work agencies in the Philippines and for other purposes. This endeavor aims to pave the way to the eventual issuance of an executive order presidential proclamation declaring 19 June as the Philippine 
or National Celebration of Social Workers Day. So we are really uh, very happy that this occurred. So next slide. On the next slide, uh, I just want to reiterate again the members of this, uh, next slide please, Social Work con uh, Consortium Philippines as, they, as seen as shown on your screen. Please uh, go on, Lizelle, kindly punch them all. So there, these are, as mentioned earlier, are the 10 members of the ASEAN Social Work Consortium Philippines. So once again, congratulations to our ASA consortium. So next slide. I would just like to reiterate. Next slide, please. I showed this last time. Go ahead, Lizelle. Next slide, please. Uh, just to let us again remember what is being a social worker, though it, we already defined it um, academically. Oops, please return, Lizelle. Back, back first, back. Kindly go back to that slide. Yes, yung being a social worker. Yes. Uh, we would like, I just like to reiterate again, this is the uh, subjective side, of course. We met, we had the definition earlier, which is the uh, official definition of uh, social worker. But uh, subjectively, this is the social worker. Being a social worker means you will never be bored. You will always be frustrated. You will be surrounded by challenges. So much to do and so little time. You will carry immense responsibility and very little authority. You will step into people's lives and you will make a difference. Some will bless you. Some will curse you. You will see people at their worst and at their best. You will never cease to be amazed at the people's capacity for love, courage, and endurance. You will see life begin and end. You will experience resounding triumphs and devastating failures. You will cry a lot. You will know what it means to be human and to be humane. So this is a uh, anonymous and read, uh, I don't know who have written this, but uh, this is the uh, subjective meaning of a social worker. And I think many of us social workers can really uh, be able to say that some of this written here, we have undergone or one way or another, we have felt this. So uh, that is the uh, ASEAN Social Work Consortium Philippines. So let us move on to the ASEAN Social Work Consortium. The ASEAN Social Work Consortium, of course, uh, as uh, mentioned earlier, uh, started, go ahead, next slide, please. Uh, started already uh, since uh, 2010. Uh, and uh, in 2019, Jess and uh, Dr. Uh, Melba and uh, of course, Mom Annie and I joined the uh, Vietnam conference wherein the main objective of that conference was to be able to come up on a definition and a declaration on social work. So this was... Uh, approved by the AMS in 2019. So now we have the Hanoi Declaration on Social Work. Uh, shown on your screen are the uh, 11 elements that uh, the Hanoi Declaration on Social Work would like to strengthen. So the Hanoi Declaration on Strengthening Social Work towards cohesive and res responsive ASEAN laid out 11 statements in accelerating the status 
of the profession. These include the necessary support in order to standardize and elevate the profession towards positive public perception and recognition. And we continue to make strides in realizing this through our cross-sectoral and interpillar cooperation across the ASEAN community and our partners. We will look into these statements one by one uh, as shown on your screen. So we will not discuss them uh, thoroughly as uh, this was already explained to you for those who have attended the June 19th. But the, for those who have the, not heard or this is your first time to read this, uh, we will have another time, I guess, to discuss this. As uh, in the interest of time, we will have to limit it on that aspect. So the next slide will show you drawing from the vision. Um, may I have the next slide, please? From the vision, objectives, and statements of the declaration, we have seven priority areas. So from that 11, we have uh, the vision, the mission, the statements. We have now seven priority areas where we can identify the necessary steps to be taken in the ASEAN level to actualize the contents of the Hanoi Declaration. As such, it is imperative that the state recognizes our profession through the passage of laws, which puts emphasis on the roles we perform in primary and secondary settings. Further, strengthened educational framework and capacity building measures have to be implemented to ensure that minimum requirements are met in order to carry out our mandated functions. And at the same time, placement of regulating bodies guarantees that the level of performance and ethics are standardized to facilitate great caliber in our work. Third, the establishment of national councils associations presents avenues for recognition and coordination among social workers building a sense of identity and camaraderie at the national level. Four, through the mentioned bodies, increased professional recognition and support are acquired. Fifth is the enhancement of the national, regional, and international collaboration. Sixth is the allocation of support for social work or service workforce, which can be lobbied to guarantee that necessary forms of assistance are provided. And lastly, enhanced value and appreciation on social work is to be strengthened to affect positive perception about the profession. Very important. Next slide. So that are, are the, those are the seven priority areas. Now we have the next slide is the recognizing the essential role of social service workforce and social work in reaching the goal set in key ASEAN instruments, ASEAN member states. In 2020, I identified social work as a priority for ASEAN and under the hair chairpersonship of Vietnam and the work plan of the ASEAN Social Work Consortium 2016-2020, Develop the Hanoi Declaration on Strengthening Social Work for Cohesive and Responsive ASEAN Community. Now, this declaration adopted by the heads of the ASEAN member states or AMS on 12 November 2020 at the 37th ASEAN Summit provided the first regional framework for social work, calling for its professionalization and expansion in the region. Next slide. The Hanoi Declaration on Strengthening Social Work for Cohesive and Responsive ASEAN Community sets a clear vision for empowering peoples of ASEAN through building comprehensive social work 
and delivering multidisciplinary, inclusive, and quality social services. So next slide. In this next slide, in relation to the Hanoi Declaration, uh, the Department of Social Welfare also came up with a draft roadmap on how to implement the Hanoi Declaration on Strengthening Social Work in the department itself. So uh, this is uh, in collaboration with the other uh, ASEAN, uh, I mean, with the ASEAN Social Work Consortium, we are asking everyone support because this is the uh, department's roadmap. So it is still a draft because the secretary, Secretary Rolly Bautista will still look into this and we hope that this will be uh, passed or signed or approved by next week so that we could already implement this. So this was done, prepared by the uh, technical working group. Uh, next slide, please. The technical working group was, uh, was created and an SO was uh, provided to ensure that this uh, technical working group has a legal basis in coming up with the roadmap, the SW roadmap. So this is composed of social workers from different uh, bureaus, OBS in the central office. And uh, incidentally, I am chairing this uh, and my co-chair is no less than Sally Dagulo of the uh, Four Piece, uh, the uh, ABD, and uh, all of the other uh, bureaus are also represented by a social worker. So one of its members is uh, the ABD of P PMB, of, that is uh, Ms. Uh, Maricel, uh, I mean, yes, Cell. Deloria, um, and the rest, we have the SO also for other social workers provided or were sent by their bureaus as the representative to this technical working group. So the technical working group has uh, these roles as shown on your screen. They are supposed to develop a roadmap highlighting inter-office, inter-agency, and intersectoral collaboration towards the attainment of the realization of the Hanoi Declaration on Strengthening Social Work, and to identify roles and contributions of concerned OBSUS or offices, uh, bureaus, uh, and service units for the attainment of commitments of the advancement of social work within the department. And third, is to provide an avenue to discuss the harmonization of related activities for the advancement of social work profession and promotion of the role of social work. Okay, along social welfare and development and contribute in building positive perception of social work. And lastly, perform other tasks that may be assigned by the secretary in pursuit of strengthening social work practice and capacity building of the social service workforce. So this, uh, this technical working group have uh, provided us this uh, draft roadmap for you to look at and uh, hopefully you will support as well. So next slide, please. So the roadmap intends to provide guidance for the DSWD in the inter-office, inter-agency, and intersectoral collaboration towards the attainment of the agenda on social work as stipulated under the commitment in the Hanoi Declaration. So that is the first objective. Second objective, is to articulate major steps expected work from 2022 to 2028 in the promotion of social work in the Philippines. And third is to provide 
a venue to consolidate and harmonize all related activities and initiatives to maximize resources needed as well as ensure greater impact. So yan po yung ating uh, objectives. Next slide. And the next slide are the guiding principles. Um, we know that uh, the social workers all have principles to follow. So uh, even in the crafting of this uh, roadmap, we have an overarching principle of the DSW roadmap. They are based on the principles and values of the social work profession, international human rights treaties, ASEAN declaration, and these are the following. Respect for the inherent worth and dignity of human beings, all services and interventions should first and foremost aim to do no harm, respect for confidentiality of personal information and protection of personal data, leave no one behind, which requires equal access to services and resources and non-discrimination, a rights-based approach upholding the Universal Declaration of Human Rights and the International Human Rights Conventions, respect for diversity along individual rights, the importance of collective responsibility, reciprocal relationships, and interdependence among people and between people in their environment. So next uh, slide, please. Next slide. So to continue, this is the meaning, meaningful participation of the people for whom services are intended. Person, including child or children, should be centered, person-centered or children-centered and survivor victim-centered approach services and interventions. An evidence-based approach to the design, development, evaluation, and improvement of interventions and services, adequate training and supervision for the responsibilities of the various social service workforce positions, a multidisciplinary and multi-sectoral approach, ensuring close coordination and partnership in the design, delivery, and evaluation of services, and regional cooperation between the AMS or the ASEAN member states and all ASEAN sectoral bodies and between key sectoral bodies at country level with key roles in strengthening the social service workforce. So uh, that is, those are the guiding principles that we have to enshrine or ensure that these are all followed in the crafting of the roadmap. So for this, uh, we, have some priority areas as well. The priority areas, however, for this DSWD have five priority areas. We lump two, which is actually uh, later on we will show you. So this is the enhanced legal framework and policy for social work. It is imperative that the state acknowledges the profession through the passage of laws which put emphasis on the roles we perform in primary and secondary settings. On this note, the department has an indispensable role in lobbying for the amendment of laws, issuance of internal policies and guidelines to guarantee that the extent of roles of social workers in the delivery of its services and performance of functions are duly recognized. For priority number two, which is strength and capacity of social work, strengthening educational framework and capacity building measures have to be implemented to ensure that minimum requirements are met in order to carry out our mandated functions and at the same time, placement of regulating bodies guarantees that the level of performance and ethics are standardized to facilitate great caliber in our work. Number three is development of knowledge products. 
to ensure the continuous promotion of professional growth and development of social workers, knowledge product that captures the necessary elements and aspects for the improvement of the practice are of significance. In addition, allocation of support mechanisms such as data management and monitoring and evaluation measures that would assist the fulfillment of social workers' roles and responsibilities would have to be prioritized, especially with the widening scope of the profession during times of crisis. And fourth, system of rewards and recognition. Considering the crucial roles performed by social workers as systems of reward and recognition is necessary to boost morale and promote the significant contributions of the profession. With the implementation of the Magna Carta of Public Social Workers, rights and benefits that are duly to be provided to social workers have to be administered. And fifth, build stronger partnerships, alliance building. With all this, the convergence of efforts and collaborations within the department and partner government agencies would greatly contribute to the appreciation and perception about the social work profession. Sustaining partnerships and alliance building is essential to foster a synchronized and comprehensive view about the necessary steps and use of resources for the development of social work in the department. Next slide. As I said, next slide. Next slide, please. In the Hanoi Declaration on Social Work, you will notice that there are seven air priority areas. For the Philippines or for the DSWD roadmap, we have um, combined number priority number five and priority number seven. So that's the reason why uh, we only have five priority areas for the SWD. So that's the comparison between the Hanoi Declaration on Social Work, and which is also being followed by the ASEAN Social Work Consortium Philippines, our seven priorities. However, for the SWD, we uh, came up with five Next slide. There are no so much. In fact, we tried. So if you notice, wait, next uh, priority number one is recognizing. Hello. Yes, uh, Yusek, uh, you may go ahead. Mukhang nagalulus ang connection ng atin pong uh, Yusek. No? Anyone? Ayan, go ahead, ma'am. Yusek, uh, Joyce, uh, go ahead. Mukhang nagkakaroon ng uh, signal ang atin pong uh, secretary. Ayan. All right. So kasalukuyan ang kanyang binabanggit itong uh, uh, review and promotion ng uh, mga related laws on uh, social work. At the same time, yung iba't ibang mga principles, ano? Uh, ayan, building positive perceptions, strengthening social work workforce sa loob ng DSWD. And uh, itong uh, engagement ng mga social workers sa tanggapan for the advanced social work practice and uh, perspective. And uh, itong uh, continued strengthening competences, napakahalaga nito, uh, Kuya Jess, yung uh, competency and uh, the social work roles in delivering quality and uh, accessible services uh, uh, to all. No? Uh, ika nga, inclusivity, inclusiveness. No? And uh, dagdag pa dito yung uh, 
pag-advocate ng uh, DSWD social workers to perform with utmost excellence. Napakahalaga nito para sa sa ating uh, tanggapan at lalong-lalo itong uh, building strong champion, no? Between DSWD, the ASEAN Social Work Consortium Philippines and the cascading and implementation of the roadmap nitong Hanoi Declaration. So Habang ang ating uh, Yusek baka nalubat ang kanyang ginagamit na laptop, ay uh, hintayin mo natin siyang makabalik. At uh, for the meantime, uh, habang wala pa si Yusek, atin mo nang bigyan ng uh, pagbati ang atin pong mga panauhin ngayon. No? Uh, we are, uh, we have uh, viewers coming from uh, Greece. No? Sa atin pong uh, Greece, uh, sa international setting ng social work uh, practice dyan sa Greece. No? Si Ma'am Maria Morfido. No? And at the same time, uh, tayo po ay pinapanood din live from uh, India Si Dr. Sakti Prabha, she's watching right now. No po? So, uh, and happy uh, viewing. Uh, sin, Laysan Pilongo, Jinky Ilagan, Mary Grace uh, Ponit. Of course, from Leyti, you know? Si Ma'am Annabel Agner. And uh, si B. Mimay, Nelda Suniga. Uh, uy, salamat kay Ma'am Mujer Hermosa. Right, nakabalik na ba si Yusek? Ayan, okay. Uh, yeah, na sorry, po. sorry. <laughs> Ayan, alright. Ayan. Yusek. Sa ibang laptop na ako. <laughs> <laughs> okay lang po, ganyan ho talaga ang atin pong uh, challenge. Ano po? So ipagpapatuloy po natin sa ibang uh, laptop. No? Ang mahalaga ay may present ng ating uh, Yusek itong roadmap ng ASEAN at the same time itong uh, draft roadmap ng DSWD para sa uh, departamento. Right, go ahead uh, Yosek Joyce. Okay, thank you very much uh, <laughs> sa lahat. Pasensya at uh, nakat na naman tayo. Anyway, uh, salamat sa una. So, ang continuation ng sinabi kanina is of course, uh, we further have other considerations that we need to look into so, isa dito is the conduct of policy researches on social welfare and development, the strengthening strengthening uh, of existing sectoral structures on children, women, youth, PWDs, family and senior citizens, and heightened advocacy on the implementation of their sectoral plans, establishment and operationalization of a national baseline data system for all sectors, strengthening national and local plans of action of all sectors and strengthening stakeholders' participation and cooperation locally, nationally, regionally, and standardization of social work curriculum, which is very important, and strengthening mechanisms and partnerships to a more effective and service delivery and workforce. Next slide, we'll be presenting to you the implementation mechanisms. To ensure the mainstreaming of the HANA Declaration, concerned offices shall integrate activities and action items in their respective plans and priorities. The second is to the progress of implementation of the work plan will be reported regularly to the Philippine SAMSWAD Secretariat lodged in the Policy Development and Planning Bureau. And third, a working group will be established to ensure the implementation and monitoring of the Philippine commitments to the ASEAN Declaration. Fourth will be a regular consultation meeting will be convened to discuss and update progress of the implementation of the work plan, as well as provide a venue to mainstream key decisions agreed upon at the ASEAN level and further directives from the Philippine Minister or ASEAN Ministerial Meeting on Social Welfare and Development or AMSWAD and Philippine Leader on Senior Social Officials Meeting on Social Welfare and Development or the SAMSWAD. This is also to ensure that key developments 
relative to Hanoi Declaration are aligned and or are considered in the priorities and plans of the department. So, uh, President Abraham Lincoln, he said, I walk slowly, but I never walk backward. Clearly, a lot needs to be done to further strengthen the social work profession. So I hope that uh, we will remember this quotation by no less than Abraham Lincoln. I would like to read it again. I walk slowly, but never walk backward, end of quote. Making positive improvements, whether big or little, will have a significant contribution in our efforts, promoting collaboration and coordination among the multiple sectors and actors contributing to social work and social service workforce, strengthening at the national, regional, and global levels will help underpin the progressive development of the profession and wider workforce and will ensure the delivery of quality and coordinated people-centered social work and social services. To end, I would like again to re for us to be able to remember this, the mantra for social work. Let us always be proud of this. I would like to read it and may you also read it with me. I am the last defense, the lone voice, a fighter, a listener, a helper, a healer. Say it loud, say it proud. I am a social worker. So once again, thank you very much for listening. And I would like to express our gratitude for uh, uh, giving us this opportunity to be with you. Sa 4K, salamat ng marami. Thank you. Back to you, sir. Okay, maraming maraming salamat po, Yosek uh, Joyce uh, Diwani, sa iyong napaka-comprehensive na presentation nitong atin pong uh, SEAN uh, roadmap. At the same time, itong uh, DSWD draft uh, roadmap which is about uh, to be finalized and maybe approved within the, the next uh, coming days, no, Yosek uh, Joyce Diwani. Kuya Jess. Yes, sir. Uh, thank you, thank you, Yusek, for the presentation. Um, I just wonder kung uh, pwede bang ma-adapt ito ng ASEAN, ASEAN Social Work Consortium Philippines with all the 10 uh, organizations uh, so that uh, mas ma stronger yung uh, uh, contribution na iba ibang organization to become a Philippine roadmap to strengthen the uh, social work in the country. Over to you, baka pwedeng marinig yung opinion ni Yusek. Yeah. Uh, salamat, Sir Jess, for that recommendation. Uh, we will really appreciate everyone's support for yeah. this para sa ganun. Kaya nga, Nandito tayo para i-discuss uh, yeah. na we have the Philippine ASEAN Social Work Consortium and uh, we are all into the promotion of our profession and uh, it is aligned sa Hanoi Declaration for Social Work. So um, all support will be appreciated. So if you could uh, have a, uh, I don't know how will this be done, maybe a how may siguro pwedeng resolution or yes, something yes. to that effect yes. supporting the uh, um, roadmap of the DSWD uh, we will uh, be happy to uh, receive all of this <laughs> yeah. and maraming maraming salamat for putting that on the floor Sir Jess not, not only supporting music but adapting it and yes, of course. Yes. Contributing uh, specific actions, no? Yes. Towards. Uh, yeah. Thank you. Uh, Thank you very uh, much, uh, sir. We we need Yung to. Uh, 
Yes, oh, oh, yes sir Jess, ano? Kagaya nga ng uh, Oo, oh, oh, nababanggit kanina yung mga priority areas ano like yung uh, uh, enhancement nitong mga legal uh, framework, mga policies for uh, social work. Yes. Uh, itong uh, uh, strengthening the capabilities napakahalaga ho nito. Dahil uh, I think lahat nangangailangan nito ano uh, pag lahat ay capacitated I mean uh, uh, capable itong hinahanap nating uh, action Kuya Jess ay yes. hindi lamang ito mananatiling drawing kundi ito ay put into yes. action talaga no at uh, makikita natin yung uh, institutionalization nito hindi lang ito adoption no pag inadopt institutionalize yan dapat yan ay regularly be done and uh, uh, be conducted na nasa puso. Kasi puso naman talaga ang pinag, uh, pinaguhugutan ng lahat ng aksyon. No? And isa pang kagandahan dito yung priority area, no? yung kapag ito ay sinagawa na institutionalized, put into action, and then itong mga knowledge products natin, we can put together para maging library ito, para maging resource and uh, yes. direct material para sa lahat. Hindi lang ito sa ngayon, but in the coming uh, uh, yung mga coming social workers in the future. And that uh, isa pang nagustuhan ko dito sa sa binabanggit kanina, itong uh, system of rewards and recognition. Alam mo ko na Jess, napakadami ng mga social workers that uh, they are working hard really, no? But they are not yet, uh, I mean, being rewarded kahit man lang sa kapiranggot na papel. No? Uh, isa, Kuya Jess, uh, reflection and realization namin ngayon, natin, mga social workers, especially sa DSWD, for the first time in the history, no? nagkaroon ng lahat ng certificate of appreciation ang lahat ng kawani under DSWD with the leadership of our honorable secretary Rolly Bautista no and that is for the first time for how many decades of service si Yosek Niwani may be witness no on that matter kasi uh, mas nauna siya sa department sa amin <laughs> sa atin kuya Jess <laughs> no pero sa ng ngayon lang tuwang-tuwa ho ang mga empleyado sa maliit na bagay na pagkilala ng uh, pinakamataas na administrator ang ating kalihim. Uh, hanggang sa laylayan, pati nga janitor, pati yung security guards, they have and uh, they be, they're be, being proud. And we are hoping that in respective organizations, ano, sa mga member ng ASEAN uh, consortium, they can also recognize uh, itong mga bagay, mga effort na nakakatulong ang bawat isa. No? Kasi pag hindi kikilalanin ito, ay siyempre kahit pa paano no baka tabangan no hindi makagalaw hindi masuportahan ang lahat ng mga galaw natin dito sa ating uh, consortium no and uh, yun isa pang napakahalaga dito na binabanggit ni ni Yosek Joyce kanina yung uh, partnership make it a strong partnership and collaboration with various uh, stakeholders or uh, agency No? Kasi ang beauty ng, ng, uh, ng resource materials or products ay magagaling dito sa iba't ibang partners. No? Mahirap kung walang, walang magbabasa, walang magsusuporta ng mga stakeholders at tayo-tayo lang nakakalam. Kahit tayo-tayo, araw-araw natin nagbabasa ito, nakikita palagay ko, ay pagsasawaan din ito. Kaya kailangan iyong uh, ibang partners natin ay uh, makasuporta para ma-promote din nila itong mga ginagawa nating efforts. Kuya Jess. Yes sir, agree. Mm -hmm. At uh, talagang kailangan, kailangan pagtulong-tulungan ng members ng consortium ang uh, 
pag-usad ng roadmap. Mm. And also strengthen yung social work as a profession. Di ba nga, yung isa nating episode, no? sinasabi ng uh, uh, ating first person, no? idadagdag na doon sa uh, pangalan ng mga social worker kung ano yung mga specialty nila. So yun yung binabanggit na isang priority ng roadmap, yung competency building. So kung uh-huh. meron ka ng specific competency na uh, social work practice in the Philippines, naka ano yun, nakadagdag yun sa iyong uh, uh, recognition. So tama yung sinasaya mo, no, Sir Ricky? Kaya kinakailangan talaga yung recognition ng efforts ng mga kasama nating social workers. Lalo na yung mga nasa liblib ng mga po, kinakailangan mabigyan sila ng recognition. Plus yung, uh, plus yung well-being ng mga social workers, so mental health, napaka-importante yan. Yes. Sa palawan ngayon, kinakailangan talaga yung mental health, well-being, well-supported, mm-hmm kailangan maramdaman ng mga social workers na meron silang pwedeng uh, lapitan, tawagan, ngayon na suporta para sa ganun yung mental health natin ay balance. Yes. Well, and well, I hope... Uh, and, yes. Okay. Where do you, Sir Ricky? Yes. Uh, siguro may tanong lang natin kay uh, Yusek. Uh, yung patungkol dito sa... Uh, Siyempre, kung may recognition tayo, uh, mayroon pa po ba ng mga naiisip? Siguro, pagpasok ng bagong administration, baka may mga dagdag pa dito no? uh, sa atin pong uh, uh, incoming secretary na maisip pa yung kahalagahan on how we can connect. Kasi we are not only into local community surges and uh, USEC uh, uh, yes. choice. But we are now in the international community and itong ating ginagawa ngayon dito sa Pilipinas ay napapanood na ho sa Greece. Ano ho? May nanonood hong mga tag- taga-Greece ho sa atin. Nagpa- nagpaabot ho sila ng message sa atin. No? Greece, Athens. At meron din ho dito sa India, sa Korea, sa Australia, sa Canada. Ano ho? At ang bago ho ngayon na nagpaabot sa akin ng pagbati ngayon-ngayon lang ay galing po dito sa Bangladesh no ho at uh, Bangladesh at, at, at sabi ho nila wow it's a good it's a good uh, uh, thing to note that Philippines is really working really fast when it comes to the strengthening of social work profession so napakaganda ho ba pakinggan na may mga ganitong mga pagkilala at pagrecognize pero yung kanina ho na binabanggit ni uh, uh, tika mo na itong si si Ma'am Ma'am Day Yako no ho uh, wag ho kayo mag-alala kasi it's not uh, all about uh, uh, the effort lang na manggagaling sa national but there is also an effort that uh, probably yung ating Alusudupi since they are also part of the consortium can continue Uh, yung yung pagbibigay ng mga appreciation and recognitions sa atin pong mga local social workers no ho yung binabanggit niyo po maganda ho ito at may nan, may nanonood ho sa atin ngayon no may nanonood sa atin ngayon ang mga officers ng atin pong Alusudupi and uh, tinitiyak ko ho na i-address po nila itong mga concerns po ninyo no ho sabi ni Ma'am uh, Wilma Nabiamos Uh, on uh, head site the roadmap oy maganda gabi director Wilma kayo po pala ito <laughs> director Wilma <laughs> oh maniya watching for the power no live promo <laughs> sabi ho niya the roadmap can be easily cascaded what are the more strategic ways to have sustained consolidated efforts on certain social work issues among social work association alam niyo ho ang ating bagong papasok na kalihim ay media personality ho ito. Media mile age po yan. And uh, sigurado ha ako pag uh, naintindihan niya ito at uh, inadapt din niya ho sa puso niya to dahil siya ay kabi- magiging kabahagi natin. For sure, baka, ho, baka araw-araw sa kanyang tolfo no? ay mak- maririnig itong mga ganito no? at sa kanya pong mga broadcasting network 
na kinaaniban pa. Let us, uh, I mean, sabi nga ni Ma'am kanina, let us uh, make uh, positive improvements, whether big <laughs> or little, will have significant contribution in all our efforts, Kuya Jess. Tama ba? Yes, Tama rin yan. <laughs> Tama. Talaga siya nga lang yan. Collective effort yan ng mga social workers. <laughs> And uh, let's all uh, support the roadmap. Yes, yes. Oh, yes. And the four case. Thank, thank you very much. Thank you, thank you. Uh, uh, and the four case, Yusek. No, ito naman ho ay hindi naman nalalayo sa DSWD. Tayo ay magkakasama. Ano, itong 4K ay magpapatuloy ho ito sa pagsuporta sa lahat po ng mga advokasya na mayroon ho tayo. And uh, this is a platform na mahirap na ho itong itigil dahil uh, ito ho ay parang uh, naging uh, uh, tambayan ng ating pong mga social workers and development workers kada Sabado whether mayroong uh, challenge sa internet connection o wala, bumaba, tumaas, tuloy-tuloy lamang ho kasi ito naman ay recorded, nababalikan, napapanood, napag-aaralan at marami hong nakaka-appreciate dito sa mga insights na ginagawa ho natin dito. Kaya let us promote partnership, no? even with the DSWD through uh, the 4Ks, the, the ASEAN Consortium with 4Ks, and the, dahil ito'y original for the social workers and development workers. Kaya, Yosek, kung mayroon pa ho kayong mga idadagdag uh, about uh, the future activities, uh, saan pa ho ba natin ito? Ano pa po ba ang mga kasunod nitong uh, steps after uh, presenting uh, to the public at the same time uh, for adoption? Ano, po, ano na po ang mga next move na ng atin pong uh, department at ang atin pong ASEAN para to level up yung atin pong social work uh, profession? Maraming salamat, uh, Sir Ricky. Yeah, of course, ang next natin na gagawin is, as, as you said, action na dapat. Hindi na pwedeng uh, yeah. salisalita lang. So, lahat sana nang na, na, na ila, na ilatag or na-approbahan at nakita natin, pinakinggan at sinoportahan na papel, uh, dapat makaskade hanggang sa pinakababa. At uh, as you said, walang problema dahil uh, isosupport yan uh, through a um, resolution or something for by the association, uh, the uh, ACWC. But more importantly, yung magkaisa tayo na i-implement ito. Uh, marami tayong struggles, especially pagka pumunta tayo sa uh, laws na kailangan ng marami talagang uh, lobbying. So we hope that yung mga, lalo na sa pag-amend ng proposal for amendment ng ating mga social welfare laws or pag uh, uh, ng Magna Carta social workers para mas, uh, mas magklaro, kailangan natin lahat yung ating mga kasama. And the uh, Lobbying sana and advocacy ang hinihingi natin sa bawat isa, lahat ng ating mga member sa consortium will uh, advocate sa kanila-kanilang mga organisasyon and siguraduhin na ito ay ma-institutionalize by the adoption, yung formal adoption ng mga pinag-usapan lalo na yung mga sa part ng roadmap ng uh, consortium by itself and of course yung roadmap ng DSWD as the uh, biggest institution na mm -hmm. nawala ata ang ating uh, USEC nagana nag-freeze oo nag-freeze ang ating USEC so by the time na ayan wala uh, Yes, mm -hmm. lumak uh, maging uh, my second sa uh, next administration uh, we are really hoping na it will be done. Mm -hmm. Action na dapat. <laughs> Yan, oo. Yan naman ang atin pong uh, hinihintay ano. Kaya nga ho uh, parang next week ata mayroon naman hong patawag ang uh, ang PASWI, PRC, PRB para doon sa mga continuous na pag-i-enhance sa pag-aamid nitong ating mga social work uh, laws 
Uh, pero uh, kuya just alam mo we are uh, finding uh, out ito pong mga bagong halal na kongresista o itong uh, senador baka mapaunlakan tayo kahit sino man sa kanila lalong lalo na yung mga nag uh, nag-adapt no sa atin pong uh, mga social welfare uh, uh, ano proposed uh, legislative agenda uh, na makapanayam tayo makapanayam natin dito para nang sa ganun eh kahit pa paano eh makatulong tayo diyan sa atin pong uh, organisasyon lalong-lalo sa pag-amyenda no at pagsuporta kapag para mapadali pero sabi ho ni Kalihim ng kaming Kalihim uh, uh, ano to uh, Erwin Tulfo na siya po ay uh, baka ho, makatulong siya dahil uh, siya po ay mayroong kamag-anak diyan ho sa Kongreso at maging sa Senado baka ho mapabilis ang pag-aprubaha uh, nito hong ating tinatawag uh, USEC. Sana hindi na ulitin pa itong uh, standards uh, bill. No? Yung standards bill, yung ating pangarap ho na magkaroon ng uh, social workers kada barangay. Uh, sana ho, ayan, ay maging priority ho. At ang uh, isa pa, itong uh, aminda uh, na gawing, gawing Pilip Filipino social workers law. Hindi yung public social workers law, no? Itong ating ano kasi para inclusive lahat. And uh, we're hoping sana ho ito ay uh, maging uh, bahagi ng trust and priorities ng atin pong kalihim uh, si Kari uh, Erwin Tulpo uh, sa darating yang term. Uh, Kuya Jess. Yes sir. Uh, uh, hopefully uh, muli ay gusto nating manawagan sa lahat ng members ng ASEAN Social Work and Social Philippines, support natin itong uh, roadmap and let's commit to do action, concrete actions. Uh, Inisip mo nga na sana magkaroon na parang signature campaign na masasabing I commit to support and act on the specific activity. Kailangan may gano'n na. Sa, eh, uh, siguro baka hindi ko lang sa Ricky, baka itong platform ng 4K is ay pwedeng maglaan ng uh, ilang minutong regularly to really update yung development ng mga nagawa ng consortium dito sa roadmap na ito. Well, Kailangan okay, gawin natin yan. Oo, Kuya Jess. Ano? At uh, akin pong uh, hihingiin kay uh, Yusek uh, uh, Joyce itong uh, kanyang uh, presentation material. Yes, uh, no? para masundan natin para masundan natin or kung mayroon po tayong uh, parang quick ano uh, short uh, parang advertisement na mga 3 yes, minute oh, ano kung mapapagawa yes, natin oh. diyan sa sa SMS natin para makatulong tayo sa pag-broadcast. Yes. Na ang magsasalita pa rin mismo ay si Yusek Joyce. <laughs> di ba? <laughs> oh, oh, yung pero may mga kasama na siyang uh, di ba parang commercial. Gagawin natin commercial pero yun ipapalabas natin. That is one way of Uh, connecting to our people no yung mga viewers natin kasi palagay ko hindi hindi pa natin lahat na namimit kahit na to ay live kasi ang iba naman ayaw man manood dahil wala silang pang data oh yes, ganun uh, mga social workers pero di bali na ho ang mahalaga ay available yung ating raw data na nandiyan sa ating uh, Facebook at saka sa YouTube ano po so uh, sabi po dito basahin ko lang po ang mga ilang comment before natin uh, Uh, bigyan ng uh, floor si Ma'am <laughs> Ma uh, Joyce. Ano, sabi niya, siguro po, uh, ito to, Yusek, sabi ni Ma'am Annabel Agner dyan sa, sa Visayas region. Ano ho? Uh, Yusek, this roadmap of DSWD is a clear instrument that will guide all social work organizations towards best social work practice in the future. And this is everybody's job. Tama ho kayo ma'am, Anabel Agner. Ano ho? Si ma'am Anabel Agner ho ay uh, official din po ito ng Alsudupi ng Paswi. At alam ko ito ho ay uh, CSWD o oh, dyan po sa ating pong uh, Visayas sa uh, region. Ano po? So ma maraming salamat sa iyo ma'am. Ma ano, uh, uh, ano to? Uh, jo uh, uh, Anabel Agner. Naging panahohin natin ito kuya. Ito pa. Yes, uh... Kami niya, siguro po Recognition para sa social workers ay hindi lang po by submitting here on write-ups but to have 
an organized group to really check on the field pa surprise kung baga well ginagawa naman ho natin ito may mga nagbabalidate mayroon naman sigurong uh, uh, hindi naman ang organisasyon lang uh, ma'am Joy ay uh, nagre-recommend kung sino lang ang gusto sa tingin ko dumadaan ho ito sa proseso dahil during our uh, conversations and uh, discussion ng criteria set para sa lahat this is true to all uh, the ASEAN consortium kung ano ang nasa uh, rule ng atin pong NASWE, yun din po ang in-apply sa iba. So may mga validation, may mga ginawa ho silang mga hakbang. Ayan. Alright. Uh, sabi nga ni Ma'am Euphemia Rubles, Thank you, Yusik Joyce, for the presentation of ASEAN Roadmap. Very well said and discussed. I'm happy I am one of the awardee of the ESWCPH 2021. The efforts and sacrifices were recognized Very well appreciated and an inspiration. Huh? Shout out! Ba? All right. Kuya Jess. Okay. Yes, Ayan. Sino pa? Yeah. Oh, Yusik, uh, ano po ba ang mga uh, masasabi nyo doon sa pwede maging pahabol na priority trust uh, na baka po pwedeng maisama sa mga discussions ninyo with the Exicom? Lalong-lalo na tayo ay nasa uh, transition. Baka makahabol pa po. Yeah, uh, hopefully, pero we'll do our best talaga. And with your support, uh, mangyayari. We'll try. So ko nga, action na talaga ang kailangan natin. But we need everybody's uh, uh, support and uh, everybody has to really work hand in hand. Sana uh, magkaisa ang ating puso at kaisipan para gawin ito. Kasi kung may kokontra, Diyan tayo magkakaroon ng medyo mahirapan tayo. So this is, I think, the time that we really have to pull uh, forces together. And uh, kasi this is for the future social workers. Uh, we need to work kasi on the end, they will ask uh, us. Baka history will judge us. Anong ginawa nyo nung kayo ang nandyan? Kaya bakit naging ganito ang aming sitwasyon? Dahil hindi kayo gumalaw. So, uh, kaya itong gagawin natin ay talagang it is more for the next generation of social workers. Uh, though we will be uh, enjoying some, but I believe talagang mas effort talaga ito for us. Uh, despite na maraming changes, marami tayong hinaharap, na mga concerns outside factors but uh, with everyone's uh, agreement and with everyone's uh, love for the profession I believe uh, we can do what we have already agreed upon as a part of the roadmap so with the next administration this is our prayer that uh, we pray that uh, this will be supported and acted upon hindi lang yung support support di ba parang but we need talaga action on this uh, especially doon sa mga specifics kasi the, what i presented to you are the uh, general uh, uh, parts lang ng ating roadmap yung mga specifics doon tayo siguro magkakaroon talaga ng mga struggles and uh, We need everyone's uh, assistance kasi yung specifics medyo maraming dinalagay doon na uh, uh, yung iba may mga nagsiguradong may mag-aayaw uh, and we have to negotiate on all these things. But uh, primarily, we hope and pray that uh, everybody, especially the social workers in the country, would hold hands to make this uh, roadmap uh, workable and make this roadmap achievable come 2025 kasi 2025 yung linagay natin dito so medyo maiksi ang panahon uh, challenge na mas malaki yun kaya nagbibilang tayo so yung next na pag-iisipan natin is mag-backward tayo 2025 so ano yung manggagawin natin nakalagay sa roadmap para ma-achieve natin ito So yun yung pinakamalaking challenge sa atin. 
Uh, and we would always look forward for 4 case to be with us in the uh, promotion and popularization of all of this. Dahil, as you said, hanggang ibang bansa naririnig ito. So we need also yung ating mga opinion ng ating mga social workers sa ibang bansa, sa ibang lugar. Para sa ganun ay mas malawak ang ating uh, magiging mga action hindi lang limited sa ating alam pero mas uh, global na tayo mag-isip. Hmm. So with that, I guess talagang maraming maraming salamat uh, again sa 4K Sir Jess and Sir Ricky for the opportunity and we look forward to listening or hearing uh, success stories relative to the roadmap. So thank you. Very, very much. Thank you everyone sa lahat ng mga nanood, nakinig. At uh, may questions man kayo, text lang sa amin. Uh, we will do our best to respond to your queries. Uh, as you said, we will always share the uh, slides with you. Um, kung meron kayong gusto pang malaman tungkol dito, yung detalya ng roadmap, once it is signed, we will surely bring it out para sa ganoon yung annexes nitong present ko sa inyo ay mababasa ng bawat social worker at sa ganoon ay alam alam ng ating mga consortium members kung paano din sila gagalaw at susuporta. So with that, maraming maraming salamat sa at, sa inyong lahat at sa lahat ng nanonood, nakikinig. God bless and stay safe always. Meet you again. See you around. All right. Thank po. you. Thank you. Yeah. Maraming salamat po ulit, Yosek uh, Joyce. Ano? Uh, sa iyong uh, napakagandang mensahe ko. Yes, ano? Parang sinabi na niya lahat. Ng, parang nag-closing na si ma'am. <laughs> uh, pero napakaganda. Is... Very well said na. Very well said na si ma'am. Ano? Pero Yosek na yung ano eh, talagang kahanga-hanga ho kayo. Yung ginagawa nyo ho ay talagang uh, nakaka-inspire sa pamumuno no? sa amin dyan. Sa DSW, lalo-lalo na sa samahan nating mga social workers dyan sa atin pong tanggapan. No? Uh, hindi man ho natin talagang kagaya ng iba na pag maggawa ng mga activities Yosek ay talagang Bunggang-bungga. Pero ang Adsui kasi, DSWD. Kaya talagang uh, ang galaw ni DSWD at Adsui e isa lang. No? Uh, kaya wala ho kaming ibang uh, magawa dyan kundi suportahan itong <laughs> mga uh, activities o plans ng ating uh, department. Kuya Jess, ang inyo pong uh, ah, mensahe. Yes, yes, yes. Okay. So uh, thank you, Yusek, no? and uh, sa inyong presentation. And hopefully... Uh, this will be an evolving roadmap na every year ay meron tayong ma-identify na milestone uh, yung agree, agree. Chip, no? and then uh, and then we can we can perhaps every year then tignan siya reviewin so that yung mga succeeding future plans in the next coming years pwede kasi mag ganiyan maging uh, mag-improve pa further no? depende sa mga mga reality in the environment. So, lagyan natin ng milestones and then lagyan natin ng uh, who are the different groups who can commit to support every milestone. Kasi bawat isang milestone ay merong contribution bawat isang asosasyon, organization. And that, I think, can be a more collective and solid support from everybody. And uh, we hope and pray that the social work profession in the Philippines will continuously excel, be recognized, and be a contributing part in the development of the country's human development perspective. Salamat po, Yusek. Thank you, and uh, good evening. Happy weekend. Over to you, Seriki. Yes, opo. Thank opo. you, thank you. Opo, okay. Maraming salamat po muli, uh, Sir Jess, and uh, Yusek Joyce. Sa aking banda naman ho, you know, Itong uh, ginagawa ho natin is not for us. Right? But this will lead the next generations coming with us. No? Ito yung mga susunod sa atin na sila ho ang magpapatuloy nito. Sila 
ang magbabago nito at mag improve nito para may fit ito sa kanilang generation. Kasi, kasi right now, this is the generation that we have and we are part of it. Connecting the world is uh, really necessary. Yang sinasabi nga natin palagi, it's not only Philippines. We learn from other countries, social work practices. Other countries are also learning from our social work practices. So why not mag-join hands together? Let us invite other countries to support this roadmap and become an influencers. And let us influence our social work Uh, practitioners across the globe, you say. And that uh, kapag na, uh, na influence natin ho sila, then the more that uh, this social work profession will be strengthened and will fly far away than what we have now. So let us uh, make a difference and let us be an inspiration to our fellow social workers and the would-be social workers coming to us very soon. Four case are always here, is always here, ready to support and ready always to promote our profession. Mabuhay po ang mga gagawang panlipunan at uh, maraming salamat sa mga nanood sa amin live dito sa four case. Paumanhin po, live tayo ngayon dito sa General Santos City, dito sa Region 12, at pagbati mula sa Luzon, Visayas at Mindanao at yung mga nanood sa iba nating iba-ibang bansa na nagpaabot ng message. No? PM na lang po ang kanilang ginawa. Hindi na po sila nag-message dito sa live. But huling hirit ko po, I am the last defense, the lone voice, a fighter, a listener, a helper, A healer. We are proud social workers. Right? Magandang gabi po sa ating lahat at maraming salamat. Samir, Kuya Jess, Ma'am Lisel, uh, Ma'am Joyce, and uh, sino pa? <laughs> Ayan. Maraming, maraming salamat sa inyo. Nena, sorry, hindi ka na ho nakabigay ng iyong magandang boses. But uh, we'll love to hear your voice next week. At para sa huling awitin po, no, pasasalamat para sa lahat. No? Again, maraming salamat sa inyo. Pagsubaybay. Alright? Thank you. Salamat po. Salamat. 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 God bless. Salamat po. Hi, salamat sa pagsubaybay dito sa po. Thank you. Salamat. Maraming salamat. Tayo ay magka sa Salamat at may gabing nakalaan sa kunting kasiyahan. Maraming salamat po sa mga tumulong at ituturta sa ating pong pagdiriwang at ikaapat ay sa tatlong alikasyon ng Pilipino o sa World Day. At patuloy po natin ang ating pasimulan. Salamat at tayo'y nagkasamang muli. Salamat at sa pagpawi ng uhaw ay may darating na araw. Kahit amis ng ating samahan sa lungkot at kaligayahan, tunay na kaibigan. Kasamang maaasahan Salamat At tayo'y may pinagsamahan Salamat Tunay kong kaibigan Masyadyan marami kong salamat Kung isa kalit ni Iplan Kaming salamat kay Oh, 
ay tamis ng ating samahan sa lungkot at kaligayahan. Tunay na kaibigan, kasamang maaasahan. Salamat na tayo'y may pinagsamahan. Salamat tunay kong kaibigan. Kaibigan, walang kapantay Salamat sa iyo Kaibigan ko, salamat sa iyo Salamat sa iyo Salamat sa iyo Alright, marami pong salamat And God bless Everyone, good night. Thank you once again, Yosek Joyce. Good night. Thank you very much. Good night, Yosek. Good night, good night. Thank you. Thank you then. See you. Happy weekend. Happy weekend. Yeah.